here from Tom Vapes. Um, I've got some juices to review today. Um, I've just realised that in my last couple of videos I've been wearing the same t-shirt, same Jimi Hendrix t-shirt for some reason. I do own other clothes and this is washed and cleaned. I don't know how it's happened. It appears that I'm shooting all my videos wearing the same thing on the same day but I'm not as you can tell I'm in a different room and my beard length gets longer and shorter. So um, I've got four juices to review today and I'm going to review them in a dripper so I'm going to drip a bit see how it vapes and then keep trying the other ones. These four juices are from uh, health e -vape. Um, .co.uk and uh, this is how it came these four in a, in a shrink uh, in a heat is it shrink wrap? no it's not shrink wrap it's a heat closed bag it's a sealed bag Let's open it up a little bit of um, advertising with the web address on the bottom there and s telephone numbers, email address, so on. They are on Facebook as well, so I think probably just type in healthy vape and it'll probably come up. And then inside this heat closed bag is another heat closed bag which I think is brilliant. This this is obviously that's obviously for packaging reasons and then this one it's a bit um, like to keep them sterile and clean, which I think is a brilliant idea. Um, just hang on a second. For these four juices, I'll just check how much I paid because I can't remember off the top of my head. It was fast delivery as well. Um, I think I did standard uh, standard Royal Mail. And I think within an hour, I got an email saying that they'd been dispatched, which is brilliant. So the total price I paid for the four juices was twenty-two seventy. These are twelve mil bottles. Uh, yeah, twelve mil bottles. Um, and the reason it cost. A little bit more. That's not how much it would cost for the twelve for four bottles of standard. I you can tailor them slightly, so you can tailor the PG VG mix um, flavor. There's two options to up the intensity of the flavors. I think it's ninety nine p uh, for extra flavor, and then you can have intense flavor. Um, you can also do the same, you can have extra throat hit uh, or intense throat hit. So let's open this. Now, I didn't. Um, bloody hell. This packaging is uh, some decent plastic. That is hard to open. What have we got here? We've got another little card. A business card. Now they have this is from the Pure Perfection range. I think they've they also I'm not gonna name the other juices that they sell because I can't actually remember without having a look. I think they have three ranges or four ranges of juice. You can also buy it in hundred mil bottles and <clears throat> two hundred and fifty mil bottles. That's not for every flavour though. Um so the bottles, nice label, as usual. And the bottles are not very big, so you can't really say about the writing on it, because you're never going to fit everything, or it's difficult to fit everything you need to fit on it. They've got good, uh, good safety warnings. Uh, and it tells you the ratios and everything on here. 
So this first bottle, I'll show you all the bottles and then I'll put them in the dripper and we'll we'll vape them. Right, so uh, the bit of the video that I shot before I shot a couple of days ago um, <clears throat> and I said I was going to try these liquids on a dripper but they're taking a bit longer to come than I expected. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try them on this, it is a dripper, it's called Bridges Atomizer. This one I got from uh, a company called Cloud Atlas Vaping. Um, and it works exactly like a drip, you put a couple of drops in and you vape away. I've got it on my Evic, which I've got a review of. It's a 2.3 ohm atomizer and I've got it on 6.5 watts. I'm pointing this out because the amount of flavour and uh, vapour produced by a liquid completely depends on your setup. So I'm using it on this setup. Obviously the amount of vapour and everything that that you get completely depends on that so just point that out for that fact you might not get the performance exact same performance that I get so uh, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to try the apple pine custard that I got it's a 70% VG 30% PG mix um, and it's extra flavour I got 12 milligrams So I'll put a few drops in there, let that soak in, um, and then I'll just put the other ones in and try those. So this is the first one, Let's see how this works then. It smells nice. Can't tell with the background, well, you can a bit. Hell of a lot of vapor off that, but it is heavily VG. Um, I could taste the apple pie. Taste the custard, it's a very nice flavor, a lot of vapor. It's quite smooth, one. That's because it's not got much PG. Yeah, all around, a, that's pretty good I'd say so the next one I'm going to try is the cinnamon spiced apple uh, again this is 70 VG 30 PG uh, no extra flavor with this one though um, I just went for the standard for this as I didn't want the cinnamon to be too overpowering um, <clears throat> so let's give this one a try So really good vapour again, smooth, uh, again because there's only 30% PG, um, cinnamon is not too, not too overbearing, you can definitely taste the apple there, only faint apple though, um, but yeah I'd say that's a nice flavour, I could vape that all day. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good, is that? Alright, so the next one I'm going to put in is this vanilla custard. Um, this one's a 50-50 mix, uh, and it's extra flavour. <coughs> as uh, I've had a vanilla custard before, and I thought it was just a bit too mildly flavoured for me. Uh, these are all 12 milligram liquids, 11 ml bottles. Mm. Yeah, not come through proper there. Yeah, that's um, definitely stronger flavoured than the last vanilla custard I got. Um, 
my throat here, obviously, because it's 50-50. Still only mildly hinted with vanilla. You can definitely taste the custard in it. There's still a fair bit of vapour for 50-50 there. Yeah, I think that's... Uh, I'd say I'd still... I only got extra flavour. I should... Probably intense flavour would be better for me. It's still mildly flavoured. I quite like strong flavoured liquids. Um, but I'm not, not unhappy with that. I could happily vape for that. Probably not all day because it's a little bit on the... Even though these are all sweet flavoured ones. It's a little bit on the sweet side for me. Right, so the last... Uh, liquid I've got here to try is uh, black curry <clears throat> and I got intense flavour on this one I can smell it already I've taken the top off it's a 50-50 mix so just a couple of drops I got this one because um, black currant is my favourite totally wicked flavour and I thought I'd get another one to try because I can tailor this flavour to make it more intense so that's the reason I got this one so let's give this a go so as you can see a hell of a lot of vapour Throat hits good on it. Um, throat is probably about right on that for me. I, I, I don't like them too throat hit here, I like them a bit smooth. Flavour wise, it's definitely a lot of flavour there. And whereas the totally wicked blackcurrant is um, more like a blackcurrant drink, or it's very close to, the, to a blackcurrant fruit flavour. This is a bit more like a sweet, um, like the blackcurrant flavoured sweets that you get. It's a bit more, not artificial, that's, but a bit more, um, I don't really know how to explain that. Yeah, like the flavour you'd get in, in a blackcurrant flavoured sweet. So uh, still produces a good amount of vapor. The, the, all, all of, I haven't really got much of a bad thing to say about any of these flavors. They all taste like what they're supposed to taste like. None of them taste artificial or chemically. Apart from maybe this one, it doesn't taste chemically. It just tastes not like the actual fruit. More of a sweet black currant. They all taste really good. Very, I'm very impressed. Um, and I'll probably, next time, if I get any of these flavours, I'll try and get them different. So, whereas I've got this one, the apple, the spiced apple, whereas I've got that one as normal, I might get it with extra flavour or intense flavour and have it 50-50 rather than 30-70. Yeah, so... Very impressed. Company wise, I think they're a good company to do business with or to purchase from, not do business with. Um, delivery was one of the best I've ever had for liquids. Next, same day, nearly. Same day delivery. So, yeah, I think they, I think definitely pleased with the company and the liquids are, are fantastic too. So that's. I think this is actually my first juice brew. I'm not sure. I've got some other juices that I haven't tried yet lying around, so I could possibly do a review on those. But I think if I do a review on those, I'll wait till my dripper actually comes. Not that this was a bad device to use. Um, easily changed the flavour in it. It's the first time I've ever used one of these or on a bridgeless atomizer. Um, I think it was. A couple of quid as well, two pound, three pound, something from Cloud Atlas Vaping. They were again a great uh, company to use. They um, they do next day delivery. No extra charge for next day delivery either. Uh, first time I've used them, so I think I'm gonna 
possibly review some more stuff from that company as well, see what they uh, you can never review a company after the first time you've purchased something or I try not to um, because uh, obviously it doesn't give you a, a correct picture of how they do business every time so um, I'll possibly review that company I've got something else I'd like to buy from them um, so I'll probably do another video on Cloud Atlas um, and possibly their liquids that I've got as well I've got a couple of liquids from them uh, that I've not tried yet so once the dripper comes I'll review those liquids as well I uh, can't remember the make of the liquids but I've never had them before and never uh, yeah I've, ne I've never tried that and the ones I've had have had sat around for a while and I've never used them so I'll probably try those once my drift has come so there's quite a few videos coming up um, with a few drippers and some other interesting things so keep a look out for those if you've liked this video check out my other videos and subscribe thanks for watching guys